What is going on everyone? Jason here from Mystical Tomes. We're going live right now to go and play the continuation of Callisto Protocol. If you want to go check it out, it's on Twitch on Dark Productions 33, and I'll see you there. Just for a recap, we had found the uh, baton and we just made our first weapon. So that's actually a pretty good head start right now. So, not too bad. Oh, it's right before this crate. This is gonna be a fun time. This is gonna be a fun time. Blizzard Protocol is an amazing game. I'm glad I waited for it. I really am. There we go. Doing some damage. It's a little tricky on the switching from the baton to the the pistol. It's a little tricky. I really hope that's true, bro, because this is this is intense. This is like the first game I've actually played. Where it's like brand new right off the line. Now I hope we can actually get the, uh... Oh, not that big guy. I'm not ready to fight that big guy. Or is that just a regular sized guy? I can't tell. Had to go let my dog out. He saw his best buddy next door. Well, I'm already sneaking behind him. Oh, that was savage. Holy crap. I wasn't expecting that. I'm going to be using that from now on. That saves me a buttload of ammo and a buttload of hurt, too. Crazy man, this is crazy. Fight. I feel like I'm just gonna be in the squatting position. Oh, that's the big guy. I'm not ready for that one. Yeah, he probably sees me. I guess, I guess the range attacks is way more efficient unless he's getting back up. He was a big guy too. That was the one off the intro, I think. Like I said, this is an intense game. This this freaking blows Dead Space out of the water. It's not even a joke at this point. Yes, is it like about a decade, decade and a half newer? Yes. But, at the same time, you're dealing with all complete, probably better storyline to tell you the truth 
But yeah, is it close to dead space? Yeah, you're not dealing with necromorph uh, necromorphs, you're dealing with biophages. So. bud. Oh good. Hopefully he, hopefully he stays down. Knowing my luck he won't stay down. If I could get a quiet kill right here, that'd be great. One round left. Oh, I'm I'm so done. We're so done. I only got one round of ammunition left. No, thank you. <laughs> one second. There we go. Do I have any? Oh, good, I do. If I didn't, have any, if I didn't have any health injectors, this would have been a very, very sketchy game, <clears throat> to say the least. Hopefully we get that suit in this in this part right here. So I'm acting a little jittery. I had a huge cup of coffee in the morning. So Is that the robot making that sound? Access denied. I can't open it. You need to find security credentials. Oh. Look around for any dead guards nearby. Any guard, any dead guards, okay. You mean all the dead people that are on the ground? I wonder what happens if I shoot the robot, but I'm not wanting to find out. Found one. <laughs> of course, he's right next to the malfunctioning robot. Use your shield to dig out their implants. Wait, what? You don't have a choice. It's the only way through that door. I mean, if he was suffering at all, or if he was in a comatose state, that's the best way to go. You put him out of his pain quickly instead of suffering. So, Sergeant Eric Jane. I guess I'll catch the next elevator then, not that. What's going on, everybody? Are they 
all in the gel cells, or where are they at? Oh, you sneaky... You got me on that one. I was like, oh, he's dead. It's not a big deal. Just take the L, dude. Just take the L. It's fine. <coughs> Excuse me. Man, this this has like a kind of effect like uh, going down the rabbit's hole like in Alice in Wonderland. You just keep going deeper and deeper and deeper until you just don't want to know what's at the very end. Not even a joke. That's not good. I can hear something, I just don't see it. Yeah, I don't like how quiet it is. This is the calm before the storm. It really is. I do not like it at all. Nice. Nice. Got six rounds, a health injector, and an energy converter. Got to be a little bit more tactical uh, on the on the usage of ammo. Cause I was going, I was going full, I was going full ham on that man. All right, got even more ammunition, which is even better, and we need it. I have a feeling I'm going to get just. I keep seeing stuff drop, like sparks and everything else, and it's like it's throwing my eyes off here. But no, I, I really feel like... Officers... Okay. Dude, like I said, these guys did so good. On the, uh, the suspense, the build-up, everything. There we are. He is creeping around right now. Just can see him. Well, yeah, if you go into my freaking Twitch, you'll see the whole thing, you goof. Just saying. Because he has evolved visibly. That's true. Dude, I'm telling you, check it out on Twitch, man. Like, these guys did an amazing job on, uh, on the whole entire game. Dead, this blows Dead Space out of the water by a landslide, man. Follow the blood. It's a good choice of words and a great tip to give me. That's fine.
Oh, I know. I got you, bro. I got you. No worries. I'm, I'm telling you right now, this this is insane. The graphics on here. I don't even remember if I was down here or not. I guess not, because there's a save point right here. Oh, there's normal people. That's good. That's good. Usually, if I remember correctly... That got my attention. Um, you do, you might scare the neighbors, however. Dude, it's not even a joke at this point. It's not even a joke at this point. <laughs> Duck and weave there, my man. Yeah, let me just say this, bro. The um, the biophages in this game, right? The biophages, they're faster and more ruthless than the necromorphs in Dead Space. Just in my opinion. When I was saying that th these guys literally made this game to have you sit on the edge of your seat, you're sitting on the edge of your seat. I only play parts of the first game and bits of the second game. Well, then you already know. Like they they show up unannounced and they just attack you. Where the biophages they they're full on like swinging at you. My boy's pulling a Kratos with these giant doors, though. I'm in medical. Keep going to the back exit. I'll contact you there. That sounds like a big guy. Please go away. I'm not ready for you yet. Yeah, like these guys, dude, they pop out of the walls. They pop out of the floor. They pop out of the ceiling. You'll have, like, hanging bodies upside down, and they just get ripped right through the freaking, like, fence and stuff. It's, it's aggressive. It's very aggressive. Adrenaline kicks in the action horror games, but it's completely lacking the horror games. Yeah, that was part three, dude. That was part three. That was not um, part one and two. I thought it was pretty decent uh, on the second one. The first one was, like, the pinnacle uh, of all three games. This is just my opinion, though. Oh, sweet. Did we get that glove? Yeah, we got that glove. There you go. So instead of the stasis glove, bro, uh, you have this glove where you basically pull them in, and then you, you launch them. That's a grip. Master does not to use it when I was in Yeah, I remember. But it's good. It works on all sorts of things to do. Come on, give it a go. I feel like I'm going to be abusing the hell out of this glove, though. I really do. One 
I supposed to grip with this? No, that's not that. Right, but how do you, uh... Right, it doesn't give you... It doesn't give you that. It doesn't really tell you what you're supposed to grab and throw at it. That's the one thing I don't understand. But yeah, dude, the, the baton is like crazy, man. The baton is literally crazy when it comes to the, the damage. I was using like a breaker bar, crowbar kind of thing earlier. Oh, okay, there it is. What's going on? We don't know. Just hold him. I'll get him on the sedative. Hurry. We got prisoners. That sedative ain't going to do nothing if he's going to be beating the living crap out of you. Oh, this is so cool. I get to actually play it, like, right in the freaking trailer, man. Oh, that is so cool. I'm dead. That guy just right hooked me and I was dead. Also about your glove, I doubt I push to doubt. It's the force grab, bro. That's what it is. That's all it is. You're using a you're basically using a glove to force bring someone over there and then to launch them into a shredder. That's the cool part about that whole thing. I didn't mean to do that. Kind of did, but I didn't. Alright, so now that I know how to use the glove... Oh, he just popped out of nowhere. God damn, this boy is like a beast boy. Boy won't go down. I should I am sucking on this freaking thing here. I am sucking at aim. I'm horrible at this. Just go down gracefully. Just go down gracefully. Oh, I have the Guardians of the Galaxy Christmas song stuck in my head. Oh, dude, same here. Every single time when there's like a, a shootout or some kind of monster fight, that's the only song that gets stuck in my head. Or you have the Michael Jackson song, I Have Somebody Watching Me. When you're going through a vent and you have that monster staring right at you. That's equivalent. I 
got two rounds of ammunition left, bro. It's not good. It's not a good look. Yeah, they sure did a number in this area, man. It's crazy how bad they did it. GRP batteries. GRP will slowly over time, slowly recharge over time, and also recharge quickly with a grip battery. If the grip battery runs out of power while holding an enemy object, it will drop. It's always good to know. Bad. Oh, and the worst part is, bro, you get these little larva things that are freaking attached to you. They literally, they literally are the equivalent of a large football-sized version of steak fat launching themselves at you. That's what it looks like. There we go. That's even better. That's even better. There we go. Is that the reforge? The choice Heck yeah. is yours. Purchased. Stability upgrade. How much? Oh, I have enough for that. Yeah. Definitely need stability. Oh, and the funny thing is, dude, it's print, it's 3D printing with lasers to up, uh, upgrade it. It's all they're doing. It's all, it's all like carbon fiber weapons that you can basically break apart and then use like a laser version of a 3D printer to make your weapons. Yeah. UGC printing. Have a united day. High capacity. Magnum rounds damage upgrade. Nah, we'll just we'll just get the upgrades of what we need right now. There we go. That'll definitely give me more rounds of ammunition for that. Yeah, the larva's not very cool. Not at all. No. Instead of a uh, power bit uh, inventory full. Really? Is it really full though? So the cool thing uh, about this is that instead of like you know uh, a node station off of Dead Space, uh, you have um, you have a little upgrade machine called the Reforge, and I was like, that is probably one of the best names I've ever seen in a video. Perfect. I have a lot of stuff right now. That's even better. Got a good amount of ammunition. Got a good amount of health. I think I think we'd be able to handle this. I've already been through here. I've already been through here. Okay. There's gonna be a vent somewhere where I can get out of here. That's not good. Bro, I found a meat locker. Look quite literally a human meat locker. That's what that is.
The one thing I will say about this is it's not a marker. It's not some kind of, uh, you know, religious zealotry going on here. It's quite literally a biological problem that is, you know, made over time through what means we don't know yet. Oh, I don't like this. It's too quiet. Looks like it's busted. Get inside. I can drive it from here. You sure about that? Gonna lower you down nice and easy. Nice and That's easy? Not too good. How is it always the system's not responding on these things? Super advanced machinery. Oh, this is just great. It goes from into the fi frying pan and into the fire. That's how bad it looks right now, man. It really does. Oh, what is that? Nope, 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 nope. That's just a whole bunch of nopes. That is the most foulest thing I've ever seen. Open on me, man. They're just freaking. Fuse required. Okay, so I need to get to this gate. This is intense, dude. Like, Dead Space had intensity, but not to this extent. Another game that I'm wanting to actually have happen is Negative Atmosphere. I don't know if any of you are familiar with that game. It was kind of like the, the unfavored child. Um, and then just stopped with the development. But... Oh my god. Stop with the freaking... Whatever that is. Oh shit, I could actually get more uh, more ammo. I got to go back to the other one then. Yeah, these guys just give out like 2-3 rounds of ammunition. So I'm full on ammo now. How many rounds of ammunition do I have? So you're telling me that a futuristic freaking society that these people live in, 12 rounds of ammunition is supposed to, like, save your life? It slightly improves the chances of surviving, but not by much. 12 rounds of ammunition. Come on now. Oh, that's horrible. Definitely taking an injector for me. 
There we go. I'm so glad I had a full entire inventory, man. It's not even a joke. <laughs> Dude, you're gonna get me banned! Stop it! I can't agree or disagree with that statement. trouble over here. Got a bunch of spikes. This is going to be a slaughterhouse, I can already tell. This is just no bueno. Trying to get me in trouble. It's okay though. Thanks. <laughs> oh, you. Oh, I was about to say, dude, do not tell me I am all out of injectors. I don't need that on me. Oh, that's good. The music's building up. I can hear that. Oh, there they are. Okay. Oh, there's a big guy, too. That's not good. It's not good. It's a big guy and a small guy. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. There's more than two of these guys? This is gonna be a smart idea on my on my behalf here. Yep, and I died. The guy right hooked me again. You know it's gross when you shoot and the IM worm comes out. Yeah, I mean, you know what the standard issue guy response is? It is what it is. It is what it is, man. Most people that's never seen that kind of thing is like, did you see that? And it's um, the guys are just desensitized by it. Go. It is what it is. All right. So where did I leave off here? Okay, let's think a little bit more tactfully here, okay? Oh, he's... Yeah, you, you go over there. You go over there. I almost didn't see him. Okay, uh... So here's how I'm looking at it. Dark Tide? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I still haven't played that. that I, I still haven't played that Dark Tide game yet. You gotta let me know how it is.
we gotta think something tactfully here. That works. That works. I feel like Coop's co-op shoulders. Yeah, yeah, I, I believe in that. So I got rid of the big guy, which was fairly easy. So now you gotta do two stealth uh, stealth finishers here. Oh, you got to be kidding me. How is there another one of you guys? How was it though? Because it's a really solid game. Yeah, I got I got to get into it, man. I I just don't have any room on my computer right now for it. <laughs> Rounds of ammunition, my guys. That works. So I need two places that need fuses. There's a fuse. I need one more fuse, though. Well, that's not going to work. Yeah, dude, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know how dark tide is, but this really makes you feel like you're in a deep space. Uh, yeah, it's 40 gigs. Yeah, no, I mean, um, I've always wanted to play it, but this game right here, dude, it makes you feel like you're in a deep space prison, and no one wants you to escape, except for like maybe a small little handful, hand few people, hand few people. I can't even say the word. A handheld amount of people. Um, that want you to succeed in escaping. Whereas everyone else is like, no. Is that a growl from a monster, or is that just something breaking apart? I don't know either. If I could take the fuse out, that'd be fine. Yeah, 40 gigs is a pretty steep price. But not that bad, though. energy converter a skunk gun schematic all right a skunk gun schematic sounds like a great weapon
I'm glad I haven't fought anything bigger except for a really big, like, strongman looking type of biophage and the big guy that, like, spews, like, giant chunks of phlegm at you. Those are the only two big enemies I have actually fought so far, which I'm very happy for because I'm not ready for anything else other than that. Alright, so I have the fuse, gotta go this way. Yeah, for real. That's not even a joke. The escape from Butcher Bay. I actually asked my roommate about that. She didn't even know who that was. To see, there's a difference between, you know, a, a decade of difference in age. They're like, who's the Chronicles of Riddick? Who's, who is Riddick? Who's Dark Fury? Like, they don't know, man. It makes me feel old sometimes. I don't know, man. It's too quiet. We're on ground level. We're gonna go up or down. We're go. Going up. Okay. It's getting good. It's getting real good. Look at the size of that thing. Lies. I'm in the elevator, I see the shoe. Elias, you there? You gotta understand how I'm only 25 and I grew up on that. Yeah, I know, I'm I'm 32. So trust me. I had some kids say I was Elias, looking like I was 45. Just because I got some road miles on me doesn't mean I'm 45, I'm 32. Thank you very much. I have a feeling that the captain dude is right there waiting for me going, Oh, so you thought you'd escape. It's been killing me not to actually find out what happens later in the game because there's all these different Callisto protocols on my uh, YouTube wall, and I can't I can't do it. I got to do it for myself. Oh, no, he's there. Okay, cool. Sorry for not responding. This thing's found a way inside here. I'm really tearing up the place. Can we still get to the shoe? Yeah. Is there a reforge unit power, in here? So I'll need to stay here and run a manual override. Don't worry. I can get you over there. I'm activating the gondola right now. It'll carry you across. That big thing is our escape. Shh, say no more. I thought it was like a little rinky dink little escape pod or something. No, it's a full blown ship. I'm good with that. Yeah, I know, right? 34 on the on the freaking long side, but these people literally, um, this kid literally said, Mom, look at the old guy, he looks 45. I'm like, who, who says that? But if I would have said that, my mom would have smacked me, like, maliciously. Oh, there's a reforge unit right there. I just gotta see if there's any other things in here. This is like the cleanest area of the whole entire game I've seen so far. The choice is yours. Alright, what do I have? I have 169. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Well, I can't afford any of this good stuff. I didn't know I had more options on the on the riot swing. Or anything, for that matter. Stand by. Find more ammo, that's for sure. Because I'm not going back without any ammo. Alright. Escape out of that. One of the cool things about this whole entire uh, game, in my honest opinion, it is almost like playing a movie. With your digits and you're actually interacting in the movie. That's how good of quality this game is. Oh, great! I got three big guys on my 12, whatever you want to call it.
Really? One hit from the big guy? That's horrible. Got eight rounds of ammunition. Yeah, I need more rounds of ammunition than that. Please make a selection. Almost took me out. Yeah, this took me out, dude. Like, it's not even a joke. I really just don't want to go up against these things because they're all waiting for me on that and I'm not ready to do that just yet or I can just pull them off you don't know I didn't think about that instead of wasting ammunition That works. Yeah, this almost took me out. It really did. That's savage, dude. That really is just straight up savage. <laughs> Those big guys aren't no joke, though. I'm definitely gonna make sure I'm at max health because I do not trust any of this. I'm gonna use my only injector that I have. take a full party to take them out. Yeah, dude, no thank you. I'm good. Yeah, no, like these things, you have the bob and weave. Full on bob and weave, that's what you have to do. or something around here. <gasps> so I do need to take those two fuses. Okay, so now that I know what to do, I gotta go and do that. I gotta take the two fuses off of here, gotta climb those giant crates, and we're gonna be good. It makes way more sense now that you talk about it that way.
We got auxiliary lighting on, that's good. Can't wait. There's a lot of twisting gears, I'm not gonna lie, I just now looked at that. Look what I get to come home to. game is too intense, dude. I'm sitting at the edge of my seat right now. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. That works. I managed somehow to climb up here. Faster than what you're doing, bud. Called it. Took my head right off. Why? Get ready for a fight, they say. Get ready for a fight, they said. Yeah, it was just a one-sided fight. Then what you doing, my dude? There's a big guy right there. It's 
not looking good for me right here, man. I got two rounds of ammunition right now. For the cell to reload on here, it's fine, take your time. There we go. by close for credits man I need health that's what I need oh you gotta be kidding me After this, I'm probably going to save the game real quick so that way I can actually uh, edit it and upload it. like a freaking pot a top that's not good it's not good it's not good all right i'm probably gonna save it right here gonna edit it and then tomorrow right after work i'm gonna play it again if you guys enjoyed this if you actually visited on twitch you saw my reaction and you enjoyed it please follow me on tiktok please follow me on twitch and more importantly follow me on youtube which is at mystical tomes on youtube so take it easy and i'll see you in the next one